Hi there YouTube friends, this is Shozy G with an opening video. I was really hoping to get this doll in while Willow was here. Um, unfortunately that did not happen. She was supposed to be in last Friday on February 13th by last Friday. She did not get in until today, the 17th. Um, so it took her 10 days from the time that I paid for her and she only came Seven, from 17 hours away from here. That's too bad. Uh, when I notified the seller that I still hadn't gotten her in over the weekend, they said, you know, basically, oh well. And I, and that's disappointing too. I got her in from eBay, so I'm really hoping that she is worth all the time and effort and the trouble here. So I'm opening her in the kitchen, and we'll see. Um, what she looks like here. So hang on while I open her. I gotta use two hands. I'm hoping you're seeing this. Um, because she was the most amazing looking doll I'd ever seen. She's actually a Madame Alexander, because I've been looking and looking and looking for a doll that looked like me. I've looked through American Girl old dolls and I found someone, uh, I think it was, um, Lainey, but I just couldn't bid on her. Oh, she's really super cute. And this is the one that I came up with. So I really hope you see her. Her hair is crazy. And this is how um, I feel some days. My son one time bought me a, um, a Barbie that sells for a lot of money now, and I still have her. And well, I hope she stands on her own. Um, she's really cute. This is this is who I thought was me. Anyway, she's a Tokyo Barbie, and she has like these, this crazy hair with blue and and uh, black or brown or something like that. And I still have her. And this is he said, if any Barbie looks like you, Mom, this reminds me of you. It's this one because I've had my hair all different colors over the years, fuchsia and everything. And this is the doll that reminded me of myself. Even the dress, a lime green. I always said if I ever got married again, I'd want a, a green polka dot 50s dress. Um, came close to that the last time I got married to Jack Bear. Um, I had a uh, green, we had a, uh, an Irish wedding and I, I made the wedding clothes. I made him a kilt and I made um, myself a uh, long flowing crazy um, dress from the, looked kind of like an Irish princess dress. Anyway, so this is, uh, so it was a green dress. Anyway, so this is her, and I don't know if the colors are coming out. Her hands are wrapped, and her hair is wrapped, but, and you probably can't catch the color of her hair. It's almost like a red fuchsia. It's not really quite red. It's not really quite um, pink, but it's somewhere in between, and she's got a little piece of fuzzy in her hair, and it's such so disappointing, and her eyes are dark blue, which my eyes are not blue, um, I always just tease my mom and tell her, because she married a man, uh, they weren't married when I was born, but, um, who had dark hair and dark eyes, and she had she was blonde and blue eyed. And I said, "Geez, if you'd only stayed in your color scheme, I'd have had blue blonde hair and blue eyes." But you know, of course, we're always attracted to our opposites. <laughs> she used to say she, my full name, you know, Shoshamali. But anyway, um, so I just wanted you to see her because I think she's really look at the shoes. These are too cute. I just really wanted you to see her. Her hair looks like it could be a really frizzy mess, so I'm going to have to be very careful with her. But it's adorable. It's like almost crimped, almost curly. Um, but she looks she looks really new. So and she's so adorable. I I have no idea what kind of a Madame Alexander she could be because I've never seen her before. She looks like something that fell out of Oz. Really, she does. Um, because she's so unusual. I'm going to turn the camera this way. So you can really get a go good look at her. Uh, I'm going to take this off of her hair, too. Well, okay. Maybe not. Uh, and that's Sig in the background. He's like, Ma, because he knows my name. So he goes, Ma. <laughs> you all know Siggy, my my uh, part uh, Siamese kitty. Wow, she is really striking, isn't she? She's breathtaking, breathtakingly fun, but 
this is this is who I would be if I was a doll, I think. Yeah, definitely. Maybe I'd have different colored eyes. I don't know. But I don't know what she'd look like with brown eyes. Probably not as cute. But she's very she's very pretty and very fun. And just her spirit, I think, is is just pretty pretty cool. I mean, who wouldn't want to have this crazy hair? That's definitely definitely me. <laughs> All right, thanks so much for watching, you guys. And um, too bad Willow couldn't have met her. She left this morning, um, and she was delivered in the afternoon. So this is Shosie G or Rosie G. Um, she might that's who she might be called. Rosie G, but we'll see. Thanks so much. Please feel free to comment and um, tell me what you think of her and what her name should be. Shosie G or Rosie G? She looks like she could be Rosie G easy because she's got that nice complexion and those pretty lips and she's got this great hair. So, all right. I can hardly wait to dress her up, but I don't want to take her out of this dress. She's too cute. Thanks so much. Take care. Have a good evening. Bye bye.